Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to move around in Sony Vegas and Movie Studio, and specifically show you how to move frame by frame in your video editing. Let's get started. Now, the first thing you see on my timeline up here is the time display. And if you right click on the time display, you can change the time format. And on mine, I have it on time and frames. What that means is the frames are shown here in the zero zero position. Hours are shown here, minutes are shown here, and seconds are shown there. As I move on the screen, I can see at the time in the video that I am, for example, this is 2 minutes and 19 seconds, and it's 28 frames across. And I can do that move around. Now, if I want to change that, I can change the time format to absolute frames or measures and beats or anything else I want to do. But I pretty much like the times and frames. Now, when you see this timeline, you can see that it's compressed all the way through here. And if I wanted to get to a point where I want to edit a frame precisely, if I use my right arrow, you notice it's jumping several frames at a time. And what I want to do is I want to jump one frame at a time. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to use Alt, Control, and Up arrow. And you notice it moved my entire timeline and spread it way out. And now when I use my right arrow, if you watch my frame counter right there, when I use my right arrow, it moves one frame at a time. Now if I want to compress my timeline again, back to the way it was, I press down Alt, Control, and Down arrow. And it gives me the compression again. So Alt, Control, Up arrow expands the timeline to frame by frame. Alt, Control, Down arrow tightens it back up. So if I get to a point where I want to edit frame by frame, I put my mouse wherever I want, Alt, Control, Up arrow, and then I can use my right arrow key to move frame by frame. In addition to using a right arrow key, I can also press Alt, Control, Shift, and use my mouse wheel to move frame by frame. This is really handy when you're editing, especially if you want to edit specifically where a frame happens. Now I'm going to go back to the compress mode, and we do that by Alt, Control, Down arrow. And to jump to the end of a video event, you press Alt, Control, Right arrow, or Alt, Control, Left arrow to jump to the beginning. Of so learning these keyboard commands can make it a lot easier to, to edit your project. Again, to jump to the end of a video event, you do Alt, Control, Right arrow to jump to the beginning, Alt, Control, Left arrow. To expand the timeline, Alt Control up. To compress the timeline, Alt Control down. While you have the timeline expanded, and that's Alt Control up, you can use the right arrow or left arrow to move one frame at a time. And you can compress it all back together by pressing Alt Control down. Again, it's very easy to do, but if you don't know how to do this, it can be very frustrating trying to find an exact frame. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips. You can find more like this at my website, www.bmyers.com. And you can find a whole lot more video tips about Sony Movie Studio in my DVD, 101 Tips and Tricks with Sony Movie Studio. And that's available at Amazon as well as my website.